So one of my favorite pieces, which is kind of funny because I have so many, but one of my favorite pieces is what I call the beach pour. And so I've decided to try it with all latex paints on this table. And if it works, this will be my sewing table after a whole lot of coats of varnish. So I've prepared it, although I have to say I, I actually messed up on the uh, order of the paints, but whatever. Um, we have the dark brown for the cliffs, that medium brown, and then the sand, or the color for the sand. And then because I felt like I needed more paint, and because I messed up, which I'll say something about in a moment, I added more there. And then over here, yes, there's the aqua, and then that's a dark blue, not a black, although it looks black in this video. The bright blue, and then the aqua. What I wanted to do, and I guess I just got too carried away and wanted to get started right away, was it should be the dark cliffs, that brownish, that reddish brown, and the tan, as it is. And then on the other side of what you see as the white should be that aqua, the bright blue, and then the dark blue. What I'm going to do next, that white in the middle, is the white latex mixed with Floetrol, which when I swipe it, should give me cells. So stay tuned and I'll come back and show you what happens. So this is right after I did the swipe and there are a few cells, not nearly as many as have happened in the other ones I've done. And that could just be because I'm using all latex kind of house paints and not really acrylic. Although I have to say that I like some of these colors. I just, they need to blend more. So I may do a little bit of tilting. I also may get the blowtorch. I think I'm going to, going to do that first. I'm going to get the blowtorch and try to get some of these cells to pop up before I start tilting. All right, be back for the next installment. So after some tilting, this is how it turned out. Not bad, actually. Not quite what I was going for. But since this is going to be my sewing table, meaning I'll put my sewing machine on it and use it, then I think it's actually pretty good. And there's some cool stuff in there. So looking at that along with the shadow, that's actually pretty cool. Got some cells. It's also all latex paint, not the acrylics that I'm used to using. So there's some actually very cool things. So even though it didn't turn out exactly the way I was hoping, I think it's I think it's pretty good. And one more week, and then I will put a whole lot of coats of polyurethane on it because it needs to um, not scratch the paint when I've got my sewing machine on it. Anyway, that's how this turned out. Thanks for watching.